Welcome to Vito. In our commitment to the catering industry, we have produced this operational video for the Vito VL. Using the Vito daily will give you oil savings of up to 50% and it will also allow you to cook a fresh, clean, crisp product to serve to your customers every time. So let's take a look at what's inside the box. Operation manual, Vito Connect instructions, Vito Connect enables you to connect your Vito to the internet, download reports and monitor usage. Shortening instructions, HACCP form, the drip tray, the base unit and the motor. 10 free filter papers to set you going. Lay the machine on its back, open the lid, take a clean filter paper, Open up the wings, making sure each end of the wing goes to the slot, the top and the bottom accordingly. Once that's into place, give it a little press down, close the lid, slot the top into the lugs, stand the veto upright, take the motor unit, place it on top and tighten up the wing nuts thumb tight on both sides of the veto. You're now ready to place it into the fryer. Skim the fryer first before using the veto to ensure any crispy bits are moved. Once you've skimmed your fryer, plug the veto into the wall, switch it on at the wall and then allow the veto to run its light sequence as shown. Take the veto in both hands with the two black handles Place it into hot oil above 150 degrees. Press the start button and allow the Vito to filter fully automatically for four and a half minutes. Once you've completed your first fryer or the first sides of the fryer, wait once you hear the beep. Lift the Vito from one fryer, allow it to drain for 20, 30 seconds before lifting it into the next fryer. Once the Vito's completed its four and a half minute cycles and you've filtered all the fryers you want to filter, allow to drain for 20-30 seconds before lifting into the drip tray, coil up the lead, clip the lead into the cable holder, Carry the Vito from the two black candles on the drip tray, place to one side, allow to cool for at least 30 minutes before stripping the Vito unit down to change the filter paper. When you're changing the filter paper, you can put this filter paper straight into the biodegradable bin, but for this purpose of the video, I'm just going to show you debris, carbon, crispy bits and everything that the Vito has taken out of the fryer in four and a half minutes. Once you've put the dirty filter paper into the recycle bin, the top housing unit must only be cleaned with a bit of sanitizer and a bit of blue roll or a rag to clean the top. Take the base unit, you can either wash this through a dishwasher or you can wash it manually in the sink, taking care to make sure you clean the slide filters. Once the Vito is clean and dry, reload with a fresh clean filter paper, exactly the same as you did before, ensuring you insert one flap at the top, one at the bottom, closing the lid, put the housing motor on again, tighten up both sides, Take your Vito to one side and you're ready to use it at the end of service for the next day.